Greetings all you Metamaniacs, this is Team Money G, and in the following video, good old Maurice and I delve into the nuanced mechanics of prepared squads. We hope you come out the other end with a thorough understanding of how Kira and each of her crew gets the prepared icon, how they lose it, and their awesome supercharged abilities while they have it. When Han Solo hit the movie theaters, our game was introduced to five new light side characters with a special synergy, the prepared mechanic. Young Han Solo, Young Lando, Calrissian, Kira, L337, and Vandor Chewbacca. Each character utilizes prep in a unique way, and we are here to break it down. We have <clears throat> a prepared a different video about scoundrels that delves deeper into the scoundrel faction and also includes the five solo characters. You can check the link for that in the description below. On your way to finding that link, make sure to hit the subscribe button and the like button and to make a little note to join us every Tuesday night at 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time when we stream live. Okay, let's dive in. When a character is prepared, it's represented by a blue hourglass icon above their heads. It's important to note that it's not a buff and it can't be copied, nor can it be dispelled. So how does each character receive the prepared mechanic? L337 is the only one that begins the match with the prepared mechanic. She's an easy one to keep the icon on, as she regains it if she doesn't take damage for a turn, or by using one of her three self-modification upgrades. Mandor Chewie has a rather complex kit, but he gains prepared each time he recovers back to max protection. It's not as difficult as it may seem, as he regenerates a lot of protection, Han can pass him more, and the cure lead also includes an element of protection recovery. Speaking of Kira, after each turn, if an enemy suffered more than one crit hit, she will regain prepared. This is quite easy to achieve as well, as there are a lot of assist mechanics within the team. Young Han grants himself prepared if he attacks an enemy with less than 50% turn meter, and Young Lando simply just has a percentage chance to regain it at the start of his turn. It's important to note that these last two characters, Young Han and Lando, also have the ability to pass prepared to another ally as an element of each of their special attacks. This is not only handy to keep the prepared train running, but we will see shortly they also boost their own damage by giving it to every ally. While each character gains prepared differently, they all lose it the same way, after they use the special ability in which prepared enhances. That's essentially what prepared is. It supercharges an ability one time, then it's gone. So let's take a look at how each character benefits from being prepared. L337 and Vandor Chewbacca play the roles of both tank and healer of the group. L337 taunts when she becomes prepared, and as we mentioned, she starts the match with it, and also when she self-modifies. So she can taunt for up to four turns to start the match with, if you desire. She also has Spark of Hope, which includes another taunt. However, if prepared, this taunt comes with a tenacity up buff for all prepared allies and a 50% heal of all scoundrels and droids based on her max health. Her max health pool can be massive, as her basic attack increases her max health by 10% when she's prepared. Remember that she's a countering tank. Bandor utilizes Prepared in two ways. First, his Freedom Fighter special deals double damage, which increases the healing provided to a target ally, heals himself for the same amount, reduces its own cooldown by two, and gives all Prepared allies protection up for two turns. His second, coming from his Zeta Unique, will also revive a light side scoundrel ally at 60% health when they're taken down. Prepared is removed after doing so, just like every ability we mention here. Prepared affects both of Kira's special abilities, the first being her Scattered Blast. Without it, it dispels the target only. When supercharged by Prepare, it turns it into an AoE dispel. Her Joint Operation Special normally calls one ally to assist, but when she's prepared, it calls all prepared allies to assist, also granting them defensive penetration for three turns. And no, there is no listed damage penalty here. Toasty! Young Han and Lando both generate extra damage based on the amount of prepared allies. Han's just-in-time deals 25% extra damage per prepared ally, and when he is prepared, he also includes himself in the protection recovery. Identical to Vandor Chewbacca and how he includes himself in the health recovery. Once zated, if Han is prepared, he has a 70% chance to assist any other scoundrel during their turn, again with no damage penalty. Toasty! Young Lando also gets the same 25% damage per, per prepared ally, however his bonus is applied to his basic. His Dealer's Choice Special grants speed up for two turns to prepared allies and has its own cooldown reduced when he himself is prepared. These two characters are slightly different as they pass their prepared to another ally before losing it. This is important to keep fueling their specific members of the team, but also any ally. 
While non-Han Solo movie characters don't get supercharged abilities, they will fuel damage to Han and Lando while reaping the benefits of the various buffs while prepared, and the effect lasts the entirety of the battle. This is incredibly important for Rage as the prepared mechanic carries over in between phases, much like Hermit Yoda's master training. Thank you for joining us. The prep mechanics are quite nuanced and a little bit complex, so I hope this video sorted out how the characters get it, how they lose it, and their abilities while they have it. Again, you can join us at 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time when we go live and talk about the game. We have guests on from all over the game, usually fans of particular factions who can help us dive deep into theory crafting and show off their great videos. You'll also find a link to our Discord in the description below. Join us there. It's a growing family of super nerds interested in getting better at this game and helping each other to do so.